Good morning guys, welcome to another vlog. If you guys haven't noticed, the first time I did today was off this brand new camera I got, or my new vlogging camera, the Canon G7X Mark II. Now, before I go on into switching over to this camera, I'm gonna first show you my unboxing experience that I had last night, so here you go. All right guys, so this is a pre-recording of the unboxing of the new cat, uh, my new vlogging camera, the uh, Canon G7X Mark II. So my dad was, doesn't want me to like open it tomorrow because he wants to make sure everything's all good. So we're gonna open this up. Uh, the reason why I got this camera now is because um, the one that we got online won't be here till I think maybe tomorrow afternoon. But by then I'll be gone to Cali, so my dad's getting me this one just to use for now, and maybe we'll return it to Best Buy once we're done with this one. And yeah, so we're gonna quickly unbox this. So we're gonna pull the knob here. And open this up, and there we go. Here's the inside. Um, there's just a bunch of warranty stuff, so there's all the stuff. But the main attraction is here. Yes, here it is. The Canon G7. Let's put this aside for now. Uh, and boom. There we go. Beautiful. This looks amazing. So yeah, that's the Canon G7X. We'll see what else is in the box. So we'll set this down right here. We'll put it right here just so it's all clean and stuff. So there's the Canon G7X. Beautiful and amazing and then this what else is in here there's just the charger the battery and what else is there uh yeah just strap i don't really need this strap though so yeah that's basically all what's inside here uh i'll see you guys in the vlog so yeah that's about it hope you guys enjoyed this little introduction of or not introduction the unboxing of the new canon g7x mark ii that's like a year and a half old almost <laughs> Yes, that is my unboxing experience with the Canon G7X. Um, I like it a lot because it's really small and portable and I don't have to worry about autofocus because it is always tracking my face. And I really like that. And it's also um, a lot easier to move around with. So, it's time to say goodbye to the Canon or uh, the T6i for my vlogging camera. And it's time to switch into the Canon G7X. Alright, we're going to switch out into it in 3, 2, 1, boom. Alright, so this is now the Canon G7X Mark II. It's really nice, really portable, and I don't know if the image quality changes that much, but yeah, this is my new camera. So, right now, um, I'm in the middle of packing out, already finished up packing my clothes and stuff, but I still gotta pack up my tech bag, so I think today's gonna be a day where I just talk about my, what's in my tech bag, and because I'm going down to Cali, I'm bringing quite a few things, so yeah, we're gonna get into that. But first, We will. So, yep, there we go. Alright, so I'm just going to quickly go through um, what I have usually in my ta travel tech bag. Um, I'm always switching bags. So for this one today, I'm using the Manfrotto Adventure camera bag. Um, the reason why I love this bag is because it has this little pocket here. It's... Um, it's basically a camera pouch pocket. Um, right here is my little strap. But the best thing is you could actually take this off. See, there's Velcro. You could take this off and use this as like, an, as like actually just like a workout bag. So you could put like clothing, food, uh, not food, sorry, clothing, uh, your water bottle, shoes, whatever you want. And just has a lot of ways to like easily access stuff. So you could put like your camera here and then like the lenses down here. So you could easily grab out your camera, put some stuff here and so on and so forth. And yeah, um... So that's my bag. I also post a link to all the things I have on my tech bag on the description below. So if you guys are interested in getting them, you could get them probably in Amazon. So I'll probably find those links. Um, next up, we're gonna go to my camera gear. So I have four lenses. Um, basically, of course, you guys know this is my camera T6i. Um, my main lens I usually go for is um, the this one, which is the 10 to 18 millimeter um, EF like lens wide angle lens so basically this is usually what I use to shoot all my vlogs um, it's got the really wide angle so pretty nice for vlogging um, and then I use these three this is like the, um, the standard kit lens the 18 to 55 millimeter um, yeah it's not bad I just use it because this is the because um, I don't have money to get a better lens but yeah and then this is the prime lens my only prime lens I have is the 50 millimeter so I use this to take portraits and sometimes some cool time lapses like from yesterday if you guys haven't seen that please check that out I use this lens as well as this old lens that my dad used to own it is the 55 to 200 millimeter so it's a big zoom lens so you can zoom all the way out and get really nice close-up shots and get that really nice bokeh effect but I mean oops let me do this but yeah it's pretty old so like the uh, focus on it is really bad but aside from that these are my four lenses uh quickly going across 
There's my glasses case. I also put sunglasses in there. Um, this is my. I, I always bring a deck of cards because I'm. Oh, I always like to do. All right. Sorry about that. I think I accidentally clicked the wrong button. So my apologies. I'm still getting used to using this camera. But yeah. So this is my two ones. This is a micro USB and sorry for the focus. Uh, micro USB and the uh, lightning USB. So I do use this to charge my iPod. Um, to listen to music. There we go. Um, yeah, I'm having a hard time getting used to um this touch. Um, focus thing. Then here's all my SD cards. I'm in the middle of using two of them. I usually have a 32 and a 60, uh, 128, and I use this to um, use this uh, micro USB adapter for my Samsung to pull out clips, and I just use this to get the SD card out. So or micro SD card. Then this is my mouse of choice. It's a Logitech mouse. Um, it's just it's just a really cheap one. There's some side buttons, so that's somewhat helpful. Uh, but yeah, I'm hoping to upgrade to the MX Performance or MX Master because those are really good vlogging. Um, and like YouTube mouse, so yeah, and this is a mouse trackpad. I also bring this light thing, micro, like this USB lighter. So like, when it gets dark and I need some light, here's that. Some cheap Ray-Bans I got. This is my, um, hard drive. Um, I'm actually using my hard drive right now to export a video. So this is just the same one. This is one terabyte. The one I have is two. Um, it's the same one. Um, it's no difference. Um, there we go. And here's my other power bank. This is the Anchor... I think it's 1675. Not quite sure, but it's pretty old. Um, it's really nice. It's the second generation Astro E5. It's really good. I always like leave this in my bag. So if I ever need to just plug something in, I'll just plug it in because there's two micro USB ports. And I just plug it in and I just leave it charging in my backpack. Um, here's my charges for my uh, Canon T6i and now my G7X. And then here's just a spray for like uh, to wipe up screens and just a microfiber cloth in there. And of course, I have to bring some kind of playing station, playing game, just so like, I get fun. So this is my um, Nintendo 3DS. I have Super Smash Bros. And I have Pokemon Sun. I'll probably bring some other games along with it, just so I can do it. And then here's all the chargers. Here's my Ray-Bans. Um, and this is my editing laptop, which is really bad. It is the MacBook Air. I think it's the 2015 one. But yeah, it really sucks. It was meant to just do a uh, schoolwork, but now because um, I'm doing more, video editing. I don't really have a laptop, so this is what I've been using, and it's really bad. So I'm hoping to upgrade soon. Um, of course, money's everything, so yeah. So this is my, what I use for, or bring to my uh, travels, and all the tech I bring. So yeah, if you guys um, want to know how, what editing things are, any of these are, I'll leave a link on the d comments description below. Oh, I'm kind of tired, but yeah. My body aches to be satisfied. My all right, finally time to head out. I already finished packing both my bags. I'm just charging my laptop right now, so we're about to head out to the airport. And it's a bit early, but I want to make sure I check everything in right and I get there on time so I don't get late for the flight. So, here you go. It's time to go to the sunny place of San Francisco. But the problem is it said it's going to rain, so hopefully it doesn't. done checking in. Alright, finally got done with security, going through security, and yeah, I've noticed there's two types of security officers. It's usually the nice officers who are willing to help you out, and the evil ones who are just bitching about you and just telling you what's wrong. And most of the people that are helping me out were a bitch. It's barely even five minutes and I already broke my suitcase. Three seconds after breaking my suitcase, it now turns into this. <sighs> Alright, so this is my first day using this Canon G7X and um, shooting regular things like this, like um, just face to face talking is great, but shooting video on this it's such a pain, it never locks on to what I want to record and I don't know, it may be because I'm choosing like the facial recognition so it's having a trouble doing that but hopefully I'll figure it out and it won't be like this and won't cause me so much troubles. Band-Aid. The band's really loud, so 
I don't know if you guys can hear me, but yeah, it's been a pretty crappy day. Oh, one way to get better is to relax, do some photo editing, and maybe sleep in the car ride or flight. I'm so tired. <laughs>